niggas, <laughs> niggas who don't know nothing about women. No, 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 no. They ain't. No, no, no. Niggas out the way. Out the way. Out way. Out the way, man. Niggas being. Stay out the way. Well, I be out the way, man. I definitely be. I be like, man, shit. I bro. hang around niggas not from here, baby. <laughs> bro, you got a problem man, with that? I met one There's person. So many of them. I met one person. Two. Erica Dutch is being one of them. Uh, okay. That was oh, yeah. 100% from Atlanta. Bro. He done sent you, he, he done no. probably got you set up. Bro. That nigga don't trust nobody. Right. Hey, I swear to God, dog. He done took in the red over and ran off. Right. <laughs> Not red, though. Hey, Erica Dutch, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah. Everybody, I be, be like, I've been living here 10 years, 15, or I just moved here, so I be like, yeah, y'all like me. Yeah. Like, y'all don't really know nothing. Nah, I still somebody would have been here 15 years, they know something. They should. Enough. Yeah, they supposed to. But you know. But I ain't know the difference. Y'all told me the difference been here between. three, though. Yeah, three. But I be leaving and stuff, too, though, so it don't be like, you know what I'm saying? I still, I think I use GPS for everything. I still don't be knowing. I don't even know right now what's the difference between Bankhead and Buckhead. Oh, oh yeah, that's what you, that you fucking up at. Oh, I'm no, no, I'm saying, I know what I'm bad, but I can't tell you which one's bad. Shit, shit, both of them bad, nigga. Oh, like, yeah. like, you I probably was sleeping in Buckhead, Buckhead, Buckhead <laughs> worse than Bankhead, goddamn shit. So I don't know, bro, but somebody, somebody had told me before, like, one was, one was good, one was bad. That's what I was told. Nah, both that's both how you know both somebody that wasn't from here. Both of them bad, but one better. And now that, and you might not see it, but it's, it's Donna Lee Hollowell, but it's still yeah. goddamn Bankhead. He probably looks he for the He looking for the word so, Bankhead. Yeah. What, what was that one, that studio y'all was at that I came when that I first That was on Bankhead. That was on Bankhead. Yeah. So, so, so that means somebody told me Buckhead was good then. Because Bankhead is Buckhead's supposed the ghetto, to be the hood, good, right? But, I yeah. know that shit was hood, because I seen plenty of crackheads and people pushing carts, all type of shit when I was yeah. outside that studio. So I knew that was hood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, were, they were ghetto as hell over there. I was like, man. Shit, they were pushing cars. They were getting money. My, what? Ain't no telling what they were selling. Yeah, y'all are different, bro. We, yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, we don't. I went on Edgewood for the first time, bro. It was like. When was this? To me, when was this? On Edgewood? Yeah. Like, I've been on Edgewood plenty of times. First time I you went You said on... for the first time. That was Oh, no, no, no. I'm saying. <laughs> that nigga no, shut up, dog. No, 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 no. <laughs> that, that was like when nigga, I Nigga, I've been a lot. <laughs> That was like oh, yeah. that was like last year. So I, I moved here in 2019. So I'm saying like, yeah, that was probably like oh, last yeah. year. But it was they they had like a Saturday or something. It was a whole it used to be a whole bunch of people out there on Saturday. Yeah, I ain't cool. know that. But it was niggas hanging out the car with big ass choppers and shit. Like right, I'm like, what the fuck, man? Right this is not Vlad TV. <laughs> what? Stop. I ain't pointing out what I'm saying. The niggas lame, man. No, I, was about the that. Shit, I was I was scared for my life, nigga. Motherfucker got me down here with the niggas hanging out the closet. I'm like, yeah. yeah. What you gonna stop? You started this shit. I ain't start shit, man. Y'all niggas need a safe. Y'all need some safer shit. And the police was on the corner just watching the niggas, bro. That gonna fuck me up. I'm like, nigga, I thought I was safe when I seen the cop. The nigga rolled past the cop, like, yeah. I'm like, what the yeah. cop was gonna do? Look, what you mean, nigga? The cop better shut the fuck up. And then everybody that did that. That nigga mind rattle a point. Bro, everybody did a little stampede run. You're not gonna, gonna do anything? Like, I'm gonna just walk out. The cop was like, like what? Well, I seen a whole edge running one way. And shit, I'm trying to like, look like, what the fuck going on? They ran. I started running. With him. I left the bitch out with that thing. I took off. I ain't lying. Like, you and your own. <laughs> Y'all can be mad at me, nigga. I'm ready to live, nigga. Well, where else you been? <laughs> where else you mean? Where else I been? You, you, you done went to <laughs> Edgewood. Uh, shit, th that's the only thing I know. It was a whole bunch of crackheads down there, too, yeah, on Edgewood, bro. It was like an apocalypse of bums, bro. Was, like, they was on every. Five seconds, bro. Like, I just bums. play the bar hop and shit. It I was, swear to God, I was scared. Niggas parking the car for you and shit, bro. I'm like, I, I learned that right away. There's some dope bars out there. Man. I didn't know that, huh? Some dope bars on Edgewood, man. Shout out our bro. Nah, y'all, I, I fuck with them. I still go down there. there. They still be no, finessing. Don't you got a spot out there? Who that? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Who that? 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 Oh, yeah, you yeah. ain't supposed to go inside. Nigga, I gotta walk to go inside. Yeah. But before I walked there, I seen all that shit. That's what I'm trying to tell you. And you still went in? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bro, I, Milwaukee ghetto is here too. It's just a different type of ghetto down here, bro. Y'all niggas different. Milwaukee ghetto is here. So you were hoping the police stopped the nigga who had the gun? You said that I what? You were hoping the police be like, hey, put that bro, in the, the car. Nigga, bro, it wasn't just him. It was more than one. Hell yeah, nigga. <laughs> The nigga I, I was with, hey, hey, but the you know we don't do that down here. Like, I mean, no, listen, I ain't saying that, but I'm saying the nigga I was with, I thought I was the toughest nigga in the world, and he ran before me. 
<laughs> this is a true story. That nigga took off. I'm like, nigga, I, like, you be talking all that shit. What are you gonna do? What you mean, nigga? The way he talked, nigga, I thought that nigga was gonna be like, hey, man, you know what I'm saying? That nigga ran first. That's I've what they walking too now. They walk nice. The police had a bungee cord holding the hood down on the front of the car. <laughs> yeah. Milwaukee. I, I was just up there. No, they be the thinking, hey, well, anytime I tell somebody I'm from Milwaukee, they be like, it's black people down there? It's, yeah, it's, yeah, they think it's white dirty people, cows, snow. and farms. I'm like, bro, it's ghetto as hell in Milwaukee. Yeah, yeah. It's Milwaukee. All the snow yeah. dirty in Milwaukee. It is. Yeah. It is. Dirty as banks of snow. So a black <laughs> snow, bro. We got black snow. We don't got white snow. I fuck with Milwaukee, though. But not in the wintertime. They show love. I just was up there. It was cool. That shit be so cold, it make your fucking face hurt. Like, <laughs> See, I'm used to it, bro, because I was born and raised there. So yeah. it's like, we just put on coats and snow suits and shit yeah. and just be outside in the snow. Fuck that. I got down here, this was like the best weather in the world. Like, when it be like 50 degrees, people be like, it's cold. I'm like, what? Like, that's like great weather in Milwaukee. Nigga, it's so damn hot right now. A oh, honey. <laughs> Oh, 110 over there in Athens and them. That's what the heat index feel like. Nigga, I walked outside today for 30 seconds. I was like, what the fuck is going on out here? It make you, what the fuck I'm doing out here? I got back in, man. Bro, this might fuck around and be the end. This shit hot as fuck. We getting closer to the sun. Man, huh? That motherfucker right here, boy. That Why y'all ain't used to that, though, boy? Y'all always been like, hot like this on normal summer. Nah, they get y'all, hot. y'all he's still no, different than the average heat, bro. Like, yeah, they, heat. I swear to God, Atlanta heat way different than other, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, other I'm, places is hot, but y'all heat different. I'm we get aware hot. of what you saying, but we not even used to what's going on right, right now. now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we we knew it was going to be hot, but yeah. this shit is, this is not normal. Yeah. <laughs> this August type yeah. shit yeah. already. Yeah. It's early on. So that's crazy. We need so some it's clouds still be, around this so it'll be hot. It still be hot in August, like this type of heat. Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm saying. It'll be hot in August. And, and, no, I'm saying Milwaukee. It's going to be August, the hottest cold, around yeah. August. Nick, she you looked. still in America. You acting like you from Brazil or some shit. No, nigga, I'm just saying in Milwaukee, though, bro, like around August, that's when it started getting cold. We didn't know the cold weather finna start hitting back. Oh. Yeah, they summer be a month and a half. Yeah, we don't get a long summer. Right. Two months at the most, bro. No. It's like, I, that's it. The rest of that shit is snow and like cool Ball, weather. my favorite season anyway. Y'all niggas don't know shit about no weather. Hey man, welcome back <laughs> to the yeah. yeah. Let's go, yeah. For my favorite season. Nigga, disrespect my cousin. Y'all don't know shit about no damn weather, man. What's Just your favorite bullshit. season? There ain't no fucking favorite season, man. <laughs> You what? can't ask a nigga in favor. Yeah, nah, yeah. <laughs> Josh, 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 no sensitive ass man, what's your like favorite? <laughs> Paul? What's your favorite scene? <laughs> Fuck you need this information for, my boy. You a spring dude. Summer. You a spring oh, dude. Man. I thought you was a winter type of nigga. <laughs> <laughs> you be asking some weird shit. Oh, <laughs> That being weird, man. I'm oh, saying what type of weather you like. He do get, he, he throw a curveball. <laughs> He always got to listen to him, bro. Well, see, Clayton will get it there. He'll explain all the seasons, then he'll answer the question. Hold on, man. Let me introduce you. You answered it. Hey, man, <laughs> we got some special guests with us in the trap today. Yeah. We got cheating ass Mary. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. And then we got dude right here. <laughs> Now, what's now up, man? Now, well, we're Yeah, yeah. No, I'm just, you ain't been here. Oh, yeah. Not by choice. I've been nah, wanting to come nah, here. No, no, you been, you, you been on some other shit. You been on tour, ain't it? <laughs> been on tour, Play ain't Play cold. <laughs> what you represent? Where you get the 85 South shirt from? I still had it at the house. Oh, OK. <laughs> you ain't got your other shirt? Shit, I got a few of them. No, I'm just saying your other, for your other tour you on. Oh, oh you know, <laughs> shout out to the high mafia. Uh, yeah. I had a couple dates. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> when I'm back home, baby. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> There's gonna be extra here. Cheating and marrying, you got you got a reputation bad, man. Black men don't cheat. Man, you crazy. You not, didn't got caught up. A few I times. Ain't, I ain't never got caught. The dog got put out. Yeah, I ain't never got caught though. The year the dog got put out, I ain't never got caught. Well, you though. keep getting accused. Yeah, I'm getting accused. I ain't never got caught. It don't matter what she say. She ain't see me doing nothing. But you had a whole ass baby. What that got? To, what that mean? It don't mean shit, but it's hard to hide a baby, my nigga. Bro, like y'all don't understand, dog. Like she, first of all, she wasn't even supposed to come home. 
Yeah, she wasn't supposed to be at home yet. Now. That's that's your that's first, first of all. Of all. <laughs> yeah, she wasn't supposed to be at home. She was supposed, supposed to be at all. work. What you mean, the least of all? She wasn't supposed yeah. to be at home, my boy. She's supposed to be at work. So I feel like I can get away with it. That's the thing. I don't care what y'all say. Y'all say black men don't cheat. We all cheat. Who is we? Me and Nav. Shit, nah, me and Nav. <laughs> my baby mama watch this shit. <laughs> me and Nav, man. You done told me some stories, boy. Yo, I'm back together. Right now, we are. <laughs> the dog said that. Shit had slowed up this year. I told you to you stop gotta... moving out of here time y'all fall out, didn't it? <laughs> that shit get expensive. Right? But I, I told you, just stay down. <laughs> just I told you. No, he move out every time he He goes. move out. He move everything. <laughs> every time you get into it. Every time. Well, what's up? The dog said he move every time he get <laughs> What? <laughs> You ain't got to worry about me. <laughs> this shit will be going, out though? of here by the Where you be Thursday. going, though? Where you be going, though? I, I Don't know. tell him, because he going to start <laughs> going. <laughs> he going to go try to. This nigga just leave. I told him that shit a while ago. I was like, stop leaving every time y'all fall out, man. <laughs> go in your room and turn the game on. I, that's, I said that, man. Like, sometimes you need to come back. Don't move all your shit out. Sometimes I used to want to get away from that shit. I did that before, but I ended up right back, too. Cause yeah. where I was like staying that. at wasn't, I was like, nah, I can't, I can't stay at this, I can't stay here either. So I go you ain't moved to another girl? <laughs> nah, I was staying at my homie, and he was, he was, he, he wasn't clean, so that's why I went back home, like, this true story. I was, you ain't his shit. <laughs> yeah, it don't matter, though. It don't matter, nigga, you still supposed to be clean, nigga, that house was dirty as hell. I'm like, ah, I'm gonna go back home. He gonna see this shit and be like, yo, do be like that in front of all the people. I ain't say his name. I could have said his name, but I ain't say no name. They knew you was staying with me. I'm the that only nigga, nigga who let you come hell. stay, nigga. Nah, yeah, he did, though. He don't let me, I had two nothing. dogs, too. He let me bring two dogs. Oh, you nigga, that's that's that. That. You no, that ain't why the dog. That ain't why I kept my dogs clean. Any nigga, that, any nigga that was like, yeah, you can bring both them dogs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you knew he nasty. <laughs> that's what he you said. You told me your own bro. That's a true story, bro. I told him, I said, bro, I can't do this shit no more, man. I, I got a movie. He said, pull up by me, bro. You can stay here for a couple days. I said, I got my dogs with me. I was like, both of them. He said, fuck about no dogs. That's what he said, though. I shit on that the That's what floor. he said. Don't shit on the He didn't say that, nigga. He said, you can't do that. Me too. <laughs> too. <laughs> but you got to be a different type of animal lover. You leave a bitch house and you take the dogs, too. Bro, I, love I had to negotiate. Look, I'm gonna come back and get the dog, but I need to get uh, myself. But, but, straight. No, but she kicked the dogs the dog. out too, though. She wasn't trying to let me leave the oh. dog. But I'm gonna tell you how it happened. This, this is true, bro. Like, but whoever get the dogs win the breakup. So how <laughs> this nigga tried to pull that shit. So how we gonna split the dogs up? Dog said that. No, nah, man. What, what kind of dogs are they, man? It's a it's a French bulldog. First of all, they, they call oh. it. It's a French bulldog and an English bulldog. Oh, you so I wasn't leaving her. I ain't know what she was gonna do with them. Was you breeding them? No, I just bought, I love dogs in real life. I was raised with dogs, bro. So you just, I you, love dogs, bro. What, what's wrong with me loving uh, dogs, bro? I love dogs. What did you mean you was raised with dogs? <laughs> no, I was raised with dogs, bro. Like, my dad, dog, my whole life I grew up with dogs, but my pops you was in the, the You dog. was in the look. No, bro, I was raised with dogs. I was in the kennel with the mother. I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, I'm <laughs> <laughs> I, I can't drink no more. <laughs> no, man, my daddy always had dogs when I was growing up, so I just grew a love for dogs. So I always wanted a dog, bro. So you know what I'm saying? So you got two. I got two. And you got kicked out. Bro. I got kicked out, but she was picking fights, bro. Like I was in the bathroom, bro, and I came out. She was like, "The dog won't go in the cage." This is a true story. I swear to God, she complained about the dog not going in the cage because he always do that, and I'm like, like he always do that. What you tripping for? She was like, "Well, you, I don't give a fuck." We got the argument. She like, well you, well, you can go in the dog. And because my pride was kicked in, because my homie was with me. One of my homies was with me. I didn't really want to leave. I ain't going to lie to you. <laughs> but my homie was with me, so I had, like, I had somewhere to go and shit. Like, I don't give a fuck. I'll take my dog. And I got in the car. We was in that bitch thinking like a motherfucker. Like, bro, he's like, bro, you going to do something? Like, we was in the car. Yeah, because I'm like, man, fuck. I'm like, man, fuck that bitch, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't give and a that nigga said no to letting you stay with him with them nah, dogs. No, but no, the, uh, the nigga that was with me, he had just moved down here, so he ain't had nowhere to go either. He was standing there with me and her. <laughs> this is a real oh, story. Hell. Oh, I know. He like, this nigga <laughs> fucking up. <laughs> He no, this ain't your way. No, this all this true, bro. I swear to God, bro. We you gotta make this work for us. He's trying to tell me, but I, I ain't thinking about it. You got a dog, you got one French bulldog bro. and a nigga. Look, and the nigga, uh, the nigga trying to tell me to calm down in the car and shit. That's uh, he ain't nowhere to go. He like, he like, man, just calm down. I'm like, man, fuck that bitch, man. I'm mad as hell, bro. Yeah, that's my homie hit me up trying to talk about a club, man. I'm like, bro, man, fuck, I'm gone. He said, come to the club. So you was at the club, homie. No, I, didn't, I never went to the club. I had, I was in the car talk with uh with my homie, right? 
And then when he hit me, he was calling me because I was supposed to meet them at the club. This all happened that same night. This sound like a yeah. good ass move so on this, too. So he told me, yeah, like, no, this real, this real. Hey, what's up? It's your man Carlos Miller. I know you're sitting at the crib watching the show, and you need to get some food delivered. That's why you need to sign up for Dash Pass. That's right. You can get 50% off your first order up to a $20 value if you use my code at checkout. The code is 85SOUTH2023. That's 85SOUTH2023. Get the Dash Pass. 50% off your first order up to a $20 value. You're going to be saving so much money, you're going to start ordering stuff from DoorDash that you didn't even know they delivered. Like cleaning products, pine saw, grapes, scratch off tickets, everything. I'm telling you, that's Dash Pass. 50% off. Use my code 85South2023 to let them know that you're up to date and valid and you've seen this recently. You're still here listening to me? Go sign up for the Dash Pass. I'm telling you, it's worth it. Say goodbye to delivery fees. Get Dash Pass from DoorDash today using 85 South 2023. When you've got zero delivery fees, you're free to get more because you can. Start your free monthly trial today. Okay, ready? We filming? Hey, nigga, hey, pop your hey, shit. Hey, homie. Pop your shit. Pop your shit, homie. Pop your shit, homie. Yeah. Weird ass nigga. Real player. Real player. Let's think. Hold up, my nigga. You being hella boosy right now. Hold up. Hey, nigga. Pop your shit, homie. You already know what it is. Nigga. Throw that shit up. Throw that shit up. Pop your shit. Pop my piece for the wannabes. Pop your shit. I might be there. I might not. Yeah, it's enough. Show them your cookies you brought with you. Nigga, look at this. Hey, nigga, they got cookies as a carry on, nigga. Nigga, cookies got shake in the bottom. You ain't never had no chocolate chip shake, nigga. What day we going? Mama's, nigga, June 4th. What fuck you talking about? Oakland Arena, nigga. Yeah, nigga. June 4th, three headed monster tour on Cetus. Nigga, on, nigga, hey. nigga on your baby, nigga. nigga. What the fuck you talking about? I ain't Hell never seen your baby. <laughs> Hella niggas, Hella nigga. Hella out there. Hella niggas already got their The bitches nigga. already out there, Hella, nigga. Hella bitches. Hella bitches, Hella nigga. Niggas. Not few, but a hella. Hella. I ain't never seen hella. Nigga on the tail. It's gonna be oh, hella bitch. Oh my mama, nigga. Oh my mama. Oh my mama. I'm gonna seek this, nigga. Oh hella my mama. No nigga. cap. And two is not hella. Fuck nah, you talking about, nigga. Get your tickets, nigga. June 4th, nigga. Yeah. Town business. Nigga. Uh, what it is? Three headed monster tour. Eh. Yeah. Show him the cookies. Cookies, nigga. <laughs> This show is sponsored by BetterHelp. Getting to know yourself can be a lifelong process, especially because we're always growing. Therapy is all about deepening your self-awareness and understanding because sometimes we don't know what we want or why we react the way we do until we talk through things. BetterHelp connects you with a licensed therapist who can take you on that journey of self-discovery from wherever you are. If you're thinking of starting therapy, give BetterHelp a try. It's entirely online, designed to be convenient, flexible, and suited to fit your schedule. Just fill out a brief questionnaire to get matched with a licensed therapist and switch therapists at any time for no additional charge. Discover your potential with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com slash 85South to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash 85South. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash 85South. Why you trying to impress a nigga? You showed nah. up because your homie was with you? Nah, but I was and he mad, didn't even bro. want him to show up. Yeah, I know, nigga, but it's like it was You should have asked him to leave. So what she like, said that made her for a second. Duh, I said that. Why you put him in our bed? Uh, Y'all ain't arguing in the bedroom? Who, me arguing? No, because she don't ever like to argue in the bedroom. She that person like to argue in front of everybody and shit. Like, she want to try to front you and shit. So I had to get you, you know, in a to toxic talk. relationship. We're just trying to get you some therapy, man. You, no, I don't need no goddamn. We've seen your chronicles online. Oh, man, that, that ain't, man. Yeah, I Look at dog. <laughs> now nah, you can't let a nigga stay with you, man. Yeah, hell no. Cause she probably was already mad about that, so she yeah, used the dog to flip the situation. Nah, we gotta understand how a nigga take up space different than furniture. 
Yeah, yeah but that nigga paying his weight though. Like I told that man, like, you can't find you gotta pay. Any reason not to let you stay at their house though, boy? Hey, hey what about that empty room you got? Nah, nigga, that's my office. <laughs> <laughs> but ain't nothing in there but an air mattress. Don't worry about how I do my work. Hey, hey man, I'm that's what he was doing. Start my little t-shirt business. Man. Man. I'm gonna have all my shit in there. Ah, ah man, my grandma staying with me right now, bro. Yeah. I we got was just here. at the crib smoking blunts this morning. You she just that. got here. Yeah. Oxygen tank, dog. Yeah. Nah, no, you can't back to everybody. I got a family like that, though. They, when they hit you with that side ass story, I be knowing what time it is. So, how long you stayed at the nasty nigga? Why you keep like, bringing that up? No, like a dog, no, bro. Like a month. I see, I was, I was gone a lot, though. You know what I'm saying? I used to go there and let my dogs out, feed them and stuff, and then I leave. So you basically just found housing for the dogs and so played with them. So you a deadbeat dead beat dog. Nigga. I know, nigga. My dog is perfect in perfect shape. How, how, I'm a deadbeat dog. Owner. You talking about you go there and walk them and leave? Yeah. Bro, I feed them, give them water, I nigga, walk, I give them time. Nigga, they need time and attention, nigga. Bro, that's why they love me. Perfection. I give them time and attention. Yeah. Man, you niggas don't even got dogs. <laughs> We, we know how to do. We, we know how to treat them. <laughs> we, don't, we don't have dogs because we know how much it takes to love a dog properly. Bro, I love my dogs properly, man. I've been taking my dog on the road. Where are the dogs doggy, now, man? sir? Sir, when the white people hear this, they're going to be like, where are the dogs now? He left them in the car. No, they're not in the car. I'm just mad. Oh, my God. Bro, my dog's at home, and they happy as hell right now, man. How you know? Because I know, bro. I've been FaceTime with them. FaceTime them. Don't say FaceTime, Your man. dogs don't have an iPhone? Wow. <laughs> What type of dog owner are you? Well, I'm a great dog you owner, man. You keep your dog. dog? Yeah, I keep tracking they my dog. They got a Bro, man. man no, 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 no niggas do that. No, who the nigga don't, niggas don't put chips on? What's your dog's birthday? Bro, I know my dog's birthday, man. When is it? May 22nd and January 26th. All right. Okay. Yeah, when you got January 26th, your dog Aquarius. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Shut know, the fuck up, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you take shit too far, what? man. What? Nah. Dog got a sign. It ain't that deep. Shit, nah, I know about Aquarius. Like, we just different, bro. Shut the fuck up. Don't compare yourself. I don't know no sign. I just know about Aries and Cancers. What I'm you an Aries. Is? I'm an Aries. But I know about Cancers because I always be meeting Cancers. Lowe's don't give a fuck, You're, but I ain't gonna, he a Aries, but he don't give a fuck. That shit don't mean shit. Yeah, don't Your birthday shit. ain't got shit to do with how shitty of a person you are. <laughs> but every time I read, I be like, some of that got to do with me. Motherfucker, they all say the same thing. Yeah, they like, switch bro. them up on you. Yeah, yeah, like, like, yeah. Any sign I read, I be like, man, that's that, Oh, that, shit. Cancer season coming up. <laughs> <laughs> Here come the Royal Leos. Right. <laughs> uh, the Royal Leos. <laughs> Goddamn, man. Cancers, bro. Them motherfuckers sensitive, bro. You ever fuck with a cancer before? I I wouldn't know. No, I you think know. I would remember some shit like that? See, I know. They just said them signs mean something for real. Oh, so you I just, just paying attention? No, nah, I don't know no other signs, though. When people tell me certain stuff about certain signs, right, and then well, I find myself dating a, a whole bunch of cancers, and they all acting the same. That's what's what the I coolest believe. sign, then? I don't, that's the only one we need to be focused on. The coolest? Like, See, who, I don't the, know who the best? I don't know. I mean, you know. I would say Aquarius, they mellow, they ain't. Man, they, they ain't saying that because that's what he is. Like, for that's me, what you is. For me, Pisces is the best. I think Aries is the best. What you is? Pisces. <laughs> <laughs> that's why you say shit. That's for me. <laughs> so you, are you Aries for real? Oh, yeah, that's like. I you know, can't man. say that. Nigga feel like him and Lowe's gonna be best friends and nah, shit. Nah, hell no, nah, bro. I'm just oh. asking because people be talking bad about Aries, man. They do. We're the they worst. They say bad shit about Aries, bro. That's why I'm asking. I we never the, knew Lowe's was an Aries. We're the worst. Of they all say the bad people. stuff, bro. Let them tell it. But fuck them people. <laughs> Dog. Goddamn. Yeah, but you and Lowe's, y'all don't act nothing alike, so you can't classify no, that. No, no, no. We ain't all the same. Aries ain't the oh. same, bro. What you trying to say I act like? What I act like to you? No, right, I'm saying you, you, like you cool, like. Los different? Man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Los cool, but wow. yo, Los, Los wow. don't fuck with nobody. Like, Los don't eat, eat to himself. Right, Los? Wow. Exactly. Yeah. That's how I am. I fuck with people. Not a fuck you. Look, you done came and told us about your homeboy business. That, no, I, I ain't know no name. 20 years. I ain't, I ain't know if you got a dog. No, 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 he ain't no got a dog, but listen. <laughs> I ain't say no name. I ain't tell you his whole business. I just said one thing about him. I said he wasn't clean. You ain't got a lot of homeboys. The people who know you gonna know who you talking about. Nah, he ain't gonna know. They gonna know where you stayed at when you I got a homeless. whole bunch of dirty friends, bro. <laughs> so it's somehow, bro. The niggas ain't gonna know. They all gonna be mad. I'm at like 10 niggas hitting me up. Like, bro, you talking about me? I'm like, come on, man. All of them, all you niggas dirty, bro. <laughs> like, 
I'm just saying. How you so, gonna talk about me? How you, you not gonna clean me, up? Man, you you think you the dirtiest same. nigga I know? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You ain't the dirtiest nigga I know, man. Like, that's all I'm gonna say. They can't say nothing. I know some dirty niggas, bro. Man, how you get started making the videos and shit? Cuz, man, I, uh... What do you mean, cuz? I've been explaining, <laughs> man. I've been explaining, man. Like, he, said, was, <laughs> like he did it out of retaliation. <laughs> like, yo. Yeah. That hey, nigga, man, nigga said like, something, I responded. He's on his last question. That nigga said something, I responded. No, I said... No, man. Look, the on some real shit, though, like... I used to see, like, uh... Country Wayne and DC doing videos. On some, that's I was saying DC on Vine, I was saying Wayne like on Facebook. You know what I'm saying? And some other nigga named Jeremiah Phillips. Y'all, y'all that ain't nigga never seen, He was on Facebook that like that funny, Hey, bro. G, you ain't never seen him? I ain't never seen him. He be little on Facebook. Funny as what hell, do you do, Jay, he funny. <laughs> he just be doing the uh, Chicago oh, nigga shit. Oh, okay. Like, yeah, he funny as hell, but I used to see that, and I used to be like, I want to do this, but I ain't really know I was going to do it. So I started making just, I started off doing roast videos of like popular people in my city and shit, and they start fucking with that. And then that start dying down. I'm like, what do I do next? So I start doing any, like just all type of videos. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't care. I was just trying to stay consistent and be on Facebook timeline all the time. And then I used to be like, like this shit ain't working, so what else I'm gonna do? <coughs> and then that cheating and admirer shit just, it just happened. Like I didn't know that shit was gonna hit like that. You know what I'm saying? I just, I literally woke up at my sister crib and was like, hey, so you were staying with your sister after you? Yeah, I was, bro. I had a job, but nigga, my, my story real, bro. I was working nine years at a job, bro. I had a job nine years. I quit. That what month. job you have in there? I quit, man. I worked at a liquor distributor, man. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga lied. <laughs> but that was good money, bro. It was just like Pepsi Coke or something, bro. Like, I was delivering liquor, bro. But I was getting like 25 what was it, like twenty seven fifty an hour, bro? Living with just Guaranteed for... <laughs> no, no, no. I lived with my sister it? for the last two years before I moved to Atlanta, so I could grind, bro. You know what I'm saying? So I could save my you money. You could have grinded listen, when you was listen, up there. Listen, I hear that. But the, the fucked up part... <laughs> shut your ass up. Hey, the fucked up part... The fucked up part is that I was... This nigga saved up the grind! I didn't save up the grind. Man, shut up, man. Hey, man, I think y'all all that damn is... Bro, I didn't... Hey, that's what happened for real, though. That's what happened for real. <laughs> get, get my struggle money. Like, hey, man. Nigga got to save my struggle. Hey, that shit funny. No, that's funny as hell. That was funny as hell. The reason that shit's so funny, but that's what happened. I saved up to struggle, bro. I lost my, I saved my, I took my 401k out and everything. That shit ran out. Bro, I took my 401k out, that shit ran out, bro. I'm still living in the basement. If you watch my first videos, bro, I was in the basement all the time, What'd you take the money out for? I was in the basement. Hey, how much you so confused, like, what the fuck is he doing? Hey, but that shit, hey, 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 it ran its course. It ran its course, motherfucker. I did do that, bro. Look, I'm not quit. Look, 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 look. No, I, hey, bro, no, it was 14, though. No, it was 14,000. That shit ran. I ran like a bottle. Hey, look, bro, you think you can throw me something on the girl? Oh, oh, no, 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 no. I'm fucking up. I'm fucking up. I did all the wrong shit with that money, bro. As soon as oh. I took that little 14,000 up, I was in the club every week, popping bottles of Ciroc, all type of shit. Right. They like, he got it. I was broke fast as fuck. <laughs> Still in that basement. She talking about she need help for rent. I'm like, man, I'm fucked up. Like, I'm fucked up. <laughs> That's why I laughed, and he said, 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 he so all the money you saved up, I didn't save it. I was spending it. I had no. I so what was the purpose of taking up the twenty seven fifty an hour? Fuck no, this job. Listen, I had listen. I Give had me my money. This is what I said. I'm retired. No, bro. I got to get that job. I had my own shit, bro. I had my own crib and everything, right? And when I quit the job, I still had a little money saved up before oh. I took the four one k. Then my sister was like, you might as well stay here with us so that you can save money, whatever, whatever. I took you advantage of that. Man. When I got there and I took out that 401k when my regular money ran out, I was just in the club, popping bottles, doing a whole bunch of bullshit. That shit ran out. I couldn't help it. So I was there, I mean, like, 
a bum living in her basement for like three years. Damn. So, so, so look, I don't give a fuck. Nigga, so I'm telling you on social years, media, so bro. Not, you, it it nine years. Nine years. Hey, nine years. You worked for nine years. Yeah, but I was good for them nine. But I just, I was good for nine. Bro, this is the way you say. I hate walking in the job to quit. <laughs> what you mean, I walk in the job to quit? <laughs> <laughs> I don't they need move. this shit. Niggas <laughs> <laughs> cut his hours by one hour. I don't need this shit. Y'all don't cut them crackers out like that. You gonna cut my motherfucker out? You with him? Y'all got the right one today, nah, motherfucker. Oh, yeah. All right. I told him, bro, when I told him, get through this shit without me. <laughs> 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 Bitch, uh, catch me on Facebook. I watched it. I watched it. You gonna see my videos on your timeline, ho? No, I ain't say that, bro. Like they were like, I just went in there and told. I, I honestly, I didn't tell them shit. I really just, I just never went back. Bitch, didn't go back. I'm I never, cheating. Ass, Marvin. <laughs> Remember the name. I wouldn't even do a, I wouldn't even do a video of that when I was quick, bro. And that I nigga, he slammed the white house door. <laughs> you know, you gotta be strong and fuck to slam that white house door. Oh man. You nah, I seen them do that shit to a nigga. They let a nigga work all night. And they, I knew they was finna fire him, but they let, they, they let him come in at night, let him work the whole night, bro. And then Don't the let morning, me work they, the whole they night. They fired. Send me home, nuts. fam. Give me time to do some shit. But he got that. He got paid for that day, didn't he? Uh, I, I, I don't yeah. know. Yeah, he worked saying. that night. He worked. They let that nigga work the whole night shift, and then in the morning they called him to the office. But I knew he was gonna get fired because. Before the weekend, a nigga stole a case of liquor and put it in, his daddy was a driver, we was loading and shit. He threw it in his dad's truck, and then right when he did it, the manager came out and was like, hey, what are you doing with that case? I was like, we loading. I'm like, shit, I ain't, I ain't do nothing. You know what I'm saying? Oh, so you snitched? No, I didn't snitch. Oh my God. I didn't snitch, bro. I snitched, listen. listen. You just, I just I listen. Listen, bro. Okay. It's only you and him, No, it don't matter. He said, what are y'all doing? He said, what are y'all doing? Hey, look at that. Shit, nigga. <laughs> Tell them about the show, man. Oh, shit, my bad. I don't even know where we're going. Hey, April 30th, we will be in Denver, Colorado. Oh! Theater. Please, right. three-headed monster tour. Hey, you yeah. nod. Did I say it right? Yeah. You're in Denver, yeah. Colorado. Yeah. Hey, what y'all put behind us on this green screen? They got to get to me. I ain't smoke nothing what yet. What y'all gonna put behind us on the green screen? That's three-headed monster? Three-headed monster. Put your bitch behind me. <laughs> <laughs> Put your bitch behind me. Three head monster. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Denver, April 30th. We got a big storm coming from the left, and we're gonna bring it down. It's called a three headed monster tour, and they're Fact. gonna come in and they're gonna sweep the whole city. Fact. Right, the left, that's the west. Put your bitch behind me. Uh, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Delco Theater. No, how you doing? We back. Yep. You bitch. Yeah. I really got a three head monster. Ooh. You gotta go to the hospital. <laughs> I, I, I did. <laughs> What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Lex P, and I have a very special announcement. Well, I already announced it, but I'm gonna let y'all know again. We are going on tour. It's starting in June, y'all. Look, we announcing it extra early so y'all got time to get your tickets. No excuses. We got LA, Philly, Chicago, Atlanta, Houston. Now, listen to me, because I know how y'all get. We are still adding dates. I repeat, we are still adding dates, but if you see your city right now, go ahead and get your tickets. If you don't see your city, don't worry. We still coming, okay? So make sure y'all go to www.poorminds.com and get y'all VIP meet and greets. We all side, poo. Hey, what's up? It's man, Carlos Miller. And April 15th, I will be in Nashville at the War Memorial Auditorium. Yeah, pull up on me. Act like you need me. And holler at the player when you see me. It's going down in Nashville. That's April 15th. Click the link. Get those tickets. I ain't never let you down. Don't you let me down. Sell this shit out. Yeah. I ain't did. Really? <laughs> okay, I might have winked at the nigga and told him. Uh, I ain't, I ain't do that. But on Monday, he got fired, bro, for after working out. Because you I told I him. Did, no, I didn't tell him, nigga. But when I got there, they never asked me no questions. They just let the nigga work. And then they was like, hey, come in the office. And they, you? Out, they told you to come in the office? Nah, they asked me oh. shit. They just went. But the nigga got employee in a month. Magic. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, I want to give it up to Lyra. No, no. I just out here. We saved the company for the no, thirty-six dollars. I tried to tell that nigga to put the case back, but I said put it back, but they on to you. But he like, no, I'm good. Bro. I'm good. <laughs> I told him to put it back, bro. 
He ain't wanna listen. What, That's kind, of, what kind of look it was? It was all type of nigga. They had Hennessy, Remy, Well, I'm talking about what kind he stole. Uh, hypnotic. Don't get too it specific. You don't want to bring the oh, case back up. Oh, he didn't steal no bullshit. He stole some hypnotic. Yeah, my girl These like white people petty, bro. Nah, uh, yeah, bro, I ain't been there in a if long time. If it was time. more than $500, they could bring it back up. You want to show Nah, they, that's not, not no hypnotic. Old. You got to steal a lot of cases. That nigga stole some hypnotic, bro. He put a hypnotic case on it. Because he was trying, honestly, I remember, he was trying to show me how to steal. Ah, and you I was working at night, tail, nigga. He said, no, I wonder what, nigga. He's, like, he's, he's taking me deep. He's showing me how to do it. He says you can get one from every shift. You can get one from every shift. There's like $130 every shift. No, that nigga told This place is a cesspool. The lunch room doubles as a casino 25 minutes at a time. The fucked up part is that he put the he put the hypnotic, like we were at the time I worked in Thursday, he put the hypnotic on the truck. Right when he did it, the manager came out. He started asking, like, what are you doing? So I'm like, I ain't did nothing. He's like, nothing. The manager walked off like nothing going on. I told I told Buddy, I said, hey man, just take it off, put it back. You know what I'm saying? Cause how they know how they account it is when we load the trucks. This the drivers specific. go the this next day. No, I'm just saying, look, the drivers go the next day, bro, and they do their delivery. They supposed to bring back a, a case. The, you know what I'm saying? Dog, daddy came. He put on the day train. His daddy came back with nothing. So that's how they knew it was stolen, bro. You can say what you want, bro. This is all the sale. He don't fuck the nigga daddy up. Fuck daddy, daddy, daddy got fired too. What was that young boy? Bro, this is it. Like this shit. Like this shit. So old, bro. This the shit, daddy like, kept his job. This shit like six years old. That means the daddy told hey, too. This shit like six years old, bro. Them niggas ain't. This so shit, what? The daddy told too. White people gonna hear about this shit in seven uh, months and be like, William. It's not that shit. He's coming off. Get fucking please. ass in here. Forgot that was your son. Yeah, Damn. you little hypnotic stealing motherfucker. <laughs> hypnotic stealing motherfucker. Thanks to Myron, we got you. <laughs> nah, hell nah. That they gonna show the 85 shot clip, nigga. He was great. We, we got a whole here. confession <laughs> on tape, Will. You ain't saying no names, bro. Ain't no bro, names. Crazy they ain't the only nigga that started. We started night. talking about Vlad, and this nigga just done went Vlad. You Vlad, yeah. bro. I ain't fucking Vlad, nigga. I ain't never snitched on a nigga in my life till today. <laughs> you just did. Till today, this is my first time. <laughs> but I still ain't said names. Other than that, I ain't never told. He so, said it till today. <laughs> you don't have to say that name. They got the name already. Bro, they ain't the only niggas that started. Vlad, what the fuck? Yeah, he said, I ain't never snitched on a nigga in my life until today. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, I'm just saying, bro, there's a lot of people still hypnotic and stuff. So they nah, can't just nah, pinpoint. Nah. Too specific though. You No, nah, I wouldn't. They could play, they could take your name, put you in a specific area. Cross reference. Cross oh, yeah, reference. Bro, Triangulate with the cell phone towers. Right. <laughs> But y'all nigga, well, how y'all know about all this extra, extra? We watch a lot of movies. Oh, y'all niggas did a lot of snitching. That, that nigga Myron was in the break room scratching his head. What's wrong, Myron? I'm just, I'm just, my dog trying to teach me how to steal. I'm just a little boy. <laughs> <laughs> you fucked up right now. Yeah, this shit kind of hard. Who? No. Who? Um, hey, Mr. Hey, James, can, can I talk to you for a second? Hell nah, bro. We all They put an extra lick on the truck, and I just feel uncomfortable. Yeah, you, gotta you just got to learn. Man, nah, he just did it too soon, bro. I learned how to do it, and I did it. I ain't never get caught. Now you confess. I don't, I don't give a damn. So that nigga probably got locked up. Nah, he ain't like Oh, that. he got fired for nah, he got fired, shit. Yeah, he's, he's trying to teach you how to steal, but you knew how to steal the whole time. Yeah, I knew how so to steal. So you was watching that shit like that, ain't Cause right? Because my uncle, yeah. <laughs> my uncle was And you didn't there. tell him nothing? Oh, no, he didn't tell him nothing. Night <laughs> tell us all. Bro, I'm part of this story, yeah, man. Man, I'm about to tell everybody. No, I'm going to like, I'm about to say the names and shit. No, no, no. Nah, you already done uncovered nah, the look of stealing ring. No, man, none of us work there no more, so it don't matter. Nobody care, but they got a whole new shift. That was shit, man. If you say so. Y'all you get a letter in the mail asking for four hundred and ninety-six dollars. So <laughs> Don't say I didn't try to stop you. So you came to Atlanta with your thousand, thousand dollars that I borrowed. You never paid a nigga. You never paid him back, did you? Did you pay him them red phones? No, I ain't had no red phones. Oh. They was like silver, like silver and black. The oh, phones, okay. bro. The nigga gave me a thousand dollars. What he said when he gave you no, the thousand dollars in the phone? This is this, this, this a nigga from the city with a lot of paper. He was like, man, I believe in you, bro. I heard you moving to the A. Pull up. I pull up. He like. First of all, I'm stupid as hell because he pulled out a big ass shoe box full of money. My pride kicking in, right? And he like, uh, he said, how much you need? 
You know how a nigga say, how much you need? And walk off. Like, he trying to jack on me with his money. So he said, how much you need? And walked off. I'm like, shit, I, I want to say about five, ten thousand dollars because it was a lot of money in the box. I'm like, just a thousand? He like, that's it, you show? <laughs> Look what he said. He said, that's it, you show? You don't need a thousand? I said, yeah, a thousand dollars be straight, man. And I'm like, he gave you some shoes. <laughs> he said, a thousand dollars, right now. So he gave me a thousand dollars. Then he went upstairs and, and man, gave me a brand new pair of phone shoes. Like, huh, man, take these shoes. How do you like, know what size you wore? Because they asked me. Uh, 11. He said, what size you wear? I said, 11. So you were supposed, <laughs> to, you were supposed to come down here and just take off and become the, uh... No, no, uh, no, uh. These niggas were nigga watching yeah. Facebook. He ain't did the shit yet. Dawson, where hey, is my money? <laughs> no, he ain't borrowed me the money. He gave me the money. So my, he couldn't he could rush me to pop. And when I moved down okay. here, first, when he I moved down here, so when I moved down here, but I popped more down here than I did in Milwaukee. Yeah. I came down here with like 90,000 followers. I, I got that half a million from living here. Yeah. I, there you go. So I'm being 100. Like, I moved out here. I moved out here with like 90,000. And then I just kept, I still kept doing what I'm doing. Then, I, then my shit took off. You linked up with Shaq? Oh. Yeah, Shaq. But Shaq wrote me when I was still living in Milwaukee. He thought that Fofo shit was real. Oh, okay. When I was rapping, the nigga DM'd me and was like, he said that rap you did was far. I was like, nigga, I, I do kind of, I'm, I'm goofy, I'm a comedian, like, I don't rap. <laughs> nigga said I'm goofy. <laughs> That's what I said, I said, I'm goofy, I do comedy. I said, I don't rap. He said, oh, nigga, I thought that was for real. So I thought that shit was like short-lived, like it's about to be dead. But then the nigga start uh, mimicking them shits and DMing me with it. And I was like, because I didn't really think it was him even when he was DMing me. Mm -hmm. Then he got the mimicking that shit in between halftime shows and sending me the videos. And I was like, you know, he like that kind of rapping. Yeah, I was well, posting that shit, out, bro. He was yeah. with the Foo Snickers. No, he like a rap, yeah, but that nigga thought I was, a, he thought I was a real rapper. Oh, man, man, you should have let that nigga, man, yeah. see, man, I'm listening to your story get worse and worse. Huh? Why you went, act like you a rapper get the money so you, like, Shaq was gonna say, but he, he went went to sign but, you. Uh, but he still, I, I ain't know that, but he still fuck with me to this day, though. He ain't never stopped but fucking with him. He was the money in your pocket? Nah, nah, he, sure. he fuck with me. Go ahead, son, man. I promise you he got some more hits. <laughs> I got, I got a lot of hits. We finna let him come on here as a manager. I'm amazing. No, but that four four shit, bro. Crazy. They, they fuck with that. Crazy. That nigga thought it was, he thought it was real. You ever saw him do the four four shit? Los just like that cheating shit, bro. I, I don't it. like it. That's I'll be trying cool. to help you get out the situation. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I see it, I'll be like, not again, man. Fuck. Bro, I never, bro. Those watch it like a scary movie. <laughs> Don't say Jump like, out the window. <laughs> go, um, go, go, she on the way. Nigga. <laughs> bro, I keep these on me for real, bro. You want them the receipts? <laughs> yeah, bro, all you gotta do is take one, bro. You ain't never get caught again in your life, huh? Nah, that might be the setup. <laughs> this ain't no setup. <laughs> nigga, this just so you know that you ain't caught, bro. Don't let it might be a setup, dog. Nah. <laughs> what the receipts? You stupid. He better plant receipt, the shit nigga. on me. You see how he try to put it on me? Yeah. Nah, Cause he bro. know my reputation in I the street side. I just trying to let you know, bro. As long as you got that receipt, bro, you ain't never caught, bro. Well, you pull that motherfucker out, you safe. None of that shit matter, like real talk. Bullshit. All right, man. Why you think she, Why you think you kept seeing multiple videos of me getting caught? Why? Because she kept taking me back because I never, really, never got caught. You heard her screaming and see me running. I was exercising, nigga. I wasn't really running. But you just don't, you don't fucking know. Man, so, uh, if you get caught cheating, you supposed to leave anyway. I, yeah, cause it ain't gonna never be fair for you. Right, cause it's like how you, you can't gonna, even really go outside. How you gonna look trust somebody car? who been looking for you, you know, looking to find you cheating? But you you had can't to go be outside with her. to call that bitch. Bitch, I'm getting <laughs> something out the car. You call me <laughs> now. I can't trust you. You cheat one time, it's over. Yeah, it's over, dog. Who the fuck you talking to, <laughs> bitch? I'm playing Madden. This is the hit for <laughs> I did a video like that and shit with the on, on, on Grand Theft Auto. You know, you, Franklin can call the, the women and shit. That shit went viral. And shit. I, I I didn't call it on the uh, on the phone on Grand Theft Auto. Grand Theft Auto. She came in there snapping on me. Talking about who bitch? What bitch is that? Nah, that shit. Yeah, you ain't never seen that one. Pull the phone up. That shit. The women I don't even. I pulled the phone up. She came in snapping. I'm like, yeah. women like, don't even check that? to see if you cheat too much. One of them. Until they break up with they side, dude. Mm. Long as she got a side nigga, she ain't gonna look. But as soon as he See that she with you, he gonna be like, oh, you with little dude, you with buddy, and cut her off, cause he in his feelings and he be mad. That's when she gonna start sabotaging the relationship. That free game right there. I'm, I ain't mean to spill it. Damn. You <laughs> spill. Women way more sneaky than men. I don't give a damn what nobody say. No, they ain't. They just, that the they men just... that they fucking ain't gonna tell yeah. on them. That cause we didn't been them niggas before. Ain't no nigga gonna come to you I and be like, hey man, before. I need to holler at you. Yeah. I've been fucking this woman for two years while you was in prison. 
Like and, uh, w- women. I care for her. I want to be with her. Nah. Nah, you just want, you just want to fuck. That's it. You just want to get your nut off. He ain't going to never come out the shadow and be like, she been with me all the time. Who no, you think some, took her on vacation? There's some niggas out there. They ain't going to do that, but there's some niggas out there. There's, there's some, some Man, suckers. women come to other women as women. Like, when, like I'm They'll coming to you as a woman. They'll every yeah. picture you like and put everybody in the group chat. Who fucking him? <laughs> Become friends and go on vacation with them hoes next summer. Uh-huh. Man. Now they fuck nigga free. Yeah. I, I feel baby. like everybody cheat though. Why you feel like that? Cause, but you can't. I just feel like there's no way somebody gonna tell me they've been married 50 years and not one time. Like that's the only. Y'all the only two. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah, you only is. been fucking him and she only been fucking. Yes, it he is. only been fucking her. Like there's no way we've been married 50 years happily. Like no, y'all didn't argue or bump heads at some point to where she went and did something else. There's no way I'm only hitting one thing for 50 years. Mm-hmm. You doing that? Yeah, once you've been with a motherfucker after so long, you don't even want to fuck nobody else. You just, it's all when, you. When, when you about 60 or something, nigga, you ain't you doing that shit? You talking about motherfuckers been together for 50 years? Yeah, but they still had to start from 50 years, a long ass time. So I'm saying within them 50 years, somebody then did something. Think about man, it. You can't even worry about the past. Right, check this, do the man. No, I'm talking about why y'all together. Like, I'm just saying, motherfuckers man. like, we ain't never seen even in 50 you, years. Like, get the hell out of here. Even if you've been faithful for the first 10 years, you out the game. Like, you 10 years behind, you can't even go outside and get no pussy no more. What you just gonna do it all? <laughs> Brute strength and good looks? That shit ain't gonna work. <laughs> shit, back in my day, we used to take women out for ice cream. What? <laughs> Nigga don't even know what a hookah is. He's Hell so far no. removed. Bitches don't even You ain't never went to the club and seen them niggas who was, who was with the wrong crowd, big ass jeans. Oh, hell yeah. Hush puppy shoes. They yeah. got the hush puppy shoes. Nigga shit creased up. Hilarious. Starts down. Freak ass outfit, dog. Exactly. Oh, yeah, I did not. Uh-huh. A- <laughs> With a bill. Oh, Big oh this part of that got bucked. This part of that got bucked. Get bucked, get bucked. Get bucked, get bucked, get bucked. Hey, this is a tight tonight. Oh, this young girl doing a chisel can- roll over there. <laughs> like, what? Nigga, see a bad bitch talking about cotton. I ain't trying to snitch. My uncle be doing that. Oh, hey. I don't say shit. How are you all good? He got to be about 60 now. He, 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 he's successful, bro. He don't look his age, though. He still be moving the groove, though. I buying he, plenty of pussy. That he is. I was going to say that he definitely buying it, because they be like. <coughs> you tell everything. I don't give a damn. I know who not to be around. <laughs> no, I ain't going to tell no real shit. This is other shit. You'll tell any goddamn thing from what man, I see. Man, shut your ass up. Man, I don't tell everything. I tell him certain some stories. snacks in this motherfucker. You telling this truth. I'm telling my truth. Talk your shit, man. Welcome back to the trap. <laughs> yeah. Where we going? Louisville, Kentucky. Man, to the hoop. The KFC Yum Center. We ain't got no KFC yet. But it's going to be at the Yum Center. Is it is Louisville it? or Louisville? It's Louisville. Louisville. Yeah, it's definitely Louisville. Louisville. Yeah, Louisville. No cap. Lo- it's Louisville. Louisville. They they nine in the back. I need, I need KFC to bring us it's, some chicken, bro. Is that close to the uh, Kentucky Derby? It's in Kentucky. I mean, but is it close to the day that we're going to be there? Hey, man, fuck all that. Bring me some bluegrass. For real. Is Bubba Johnson gonna be there? Bubba Johnson? Yeah. That nigga, Bubba Johnson ride horses? He the NASCAR. Can, can you tell you I thought that was a car? No, nigga, that's <laughs> <laughs> Hey, man, come to the show. Come to the show a little bit. Bring a horse. Ignore what you said. Yeah. Give him a cup. See y'all, baby. That's the NASCAR girl? Yeah. I thought it can take a dirt with the car. No, that's. <laughs> <laughs> That's the Daytona 500, nigga. Nigga, Kentucky nigga. Derby. Ain't nobody told me. That's why I won't take you no fucking way. Hey, man. That's get, what? Get your tickets. May 20th, KFC Yum Center. Shit, take me to the horses then. You <laughs> <laughs> got that, y'all. Yeah, you got that. But I always thought the Kentucky Derby was a horse, I meant with a car. Man, what's up, man? This your boy, Nav Green. This your boy, Moneybag Mafioso. Man, if you not hip to war on drugs, if you ain't checked out, the last episode, episode seven, episode that's the one to listen seven. to. Man. That's the one to type in I'm to. Hey, this is my only thing. All right, Greg Glaude, I can understand him. But Clayton, 
it just be sounding like he be saying first-hand point of view of some of them drugs. I agree. He know Bruh, too much. Yeah, he know too much. Ain't no way you studying it. It's like he be talking like what the drugs did to him. Right. <laughs> I don't know. Let's shit. Listening to him, I, I, I ain't even know opioid was in uh, lean. Oh, and you was a habitual. Uh, habitual oh, ex Yeah, <laughs> you was well known with his So goal. clearly yeah. I used to be a heroin addict. Yeah. 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 <laughs> No, bro, but I think with that, let me put some of that stuff. Sooner or later, they gonna say some of that stuff in weed. They they try to get all of it. It probably is in weed. But, but I'm it, saying, I, I just like how they, how, they, how they break down, you know, the percentages of those, you know, who are more prone to being hooked on drugs. Like they they talk about the age limit and all that. But man. it's some of the stuff they be saying. Like I be feeling like it's excuses. Like, you know, if some people be bored, no after school programs, it'll lead them to drugs. Man, I didn't I didn't have no after school program. I had all that shit, it still got high. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, I know somebody who used to ride their bike faithfully from the after school program. To, to go, go get, get high. Some, go Hell get yeah, high. that's me. So, so it's like, you can't blame it on that. Yeah, for sure. But if they say, uh, I was looking on one part, they were talking about 80% of the people that are addicted to drugs aren't prescribed. You think? Right. Because <laughs> if you prescribe this shit, you going to use it when you're supposed right, to use right, it. Right, right, right. If did you, you addicted him? to something, you don't follow the directions. Right. That's, that's key. So it's like, they do it, they telling us stuff we already know. Did you hear when they were talking about the white lady, though? In, in, oh, the uh, reporter? Yeah. Man, I thought I was listening to a Narcos episode. You ain't lying. Man, she was running them folk dry. She run herself dry, too. Yeah, but she ain't get no time. Right, that's that's something that they talk about. Y'all need to tune in on that. I ain't lying. They're breaking it down. They're breaking it all the way tell down. This. Now, if that would have been somebody black at Clark Atlanta, mm. motherfucker be doing 43 years it to this man, day. Man, ain't even had to be Clark. Where it could be? The crim. <laughs> it could have be been at school. your local high school, <laughs> Dub High. It'd have been a different story. Man, but like, okay, but uh, <laughs> all the only thing about the punk is why they read the obituaries at the end. Yeah. Like, they make that man. It like it like I feel like it's an unsung episode because everything be going good. They talk chill, then they read the old dreadful obituary. They trying to get they just really war on drugs, man. They trying well, to get him over the stop. That's what I'm trying to say. You gonna be? It need to be a war on fentanyl alone by itself. Yeah, but you gonna be one of the clients if you don't soon stop that link. Who me? I mean, uh. Well, you stopped the lean, but I'm talking about if you really don't stop. I really just found out that shit was in there, so it don't count for real. Yeah, you know it been in there. It been in there as long as you been doing it. I need another six months <laughs> before it kick in. Before it kick in. That means it's in Percocet too then. No, ain't no way. That's what they need to break all that down. I'm pretty sure. I need to call Clay, man, and make sure man, he break Clay all that down. Clay on that shit now. Yeah, Clay on that shit right yeah. now. No, but Greg Glide just sound like I know you as some bullshit. Yeah, <laughs> bro, I think both of them do all the drugs before they start the each episode. What about the uh, the case that Clay fighting with Atlanta? Oh no. Nah. Oh, in that case, mm -hmm. Clay don't do no drugs. Right. I want him to get that money so he can put Hell that you go so he can. <clears throat> yeah, like I was saying, I just don't like how they 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 target black successful men, and, and when they just focusing on their family, he's a good loving father. Come on, man. Oh, he man. do a little opioid yeah. here once in a while. That don't mean he should be judged. <laughs> no. That don't mean stop a black man, you know, before he get on the plane like he got them. Pablo Escobar, man, you know. Man, Clay had one nickel bag. They, they uh, threw, cocaine. <laughs> he threw him down on the ground. <laughs> Get the fuck on the ground. Get the fuck up. Hey, man, I ain't got nothing. What's this? <laughs> he, he put it in Clay. What's this? Him and uh, Eric nothing. Andre. Yeah, Eric yeah, Andre. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm tuned in. I love it, man. I love the show, man. War on drugs. But they say if you don't be addicted to a, uh, a drug by, I think, by 20 or something like that, I, I saw them saying that, then you ain't gonna, you ain't gonna really live your life. You ain't gonna live your life if you're not addicted to it by 20? Like, basically, you gotta get addicted. You gotta early. do something. Yeah, early. Like, you ain't gonna be done, live your whole life. <laughs> if you ain't getting high. Or you done tried something. Okay. It didn't take me to 20. Well, I'm getting high like 12 years old. <laughs> but that weed, right? I hope. 
I said I was getting high like 12 years old. Hey, man. Cigarettes, whatever I get my Bro, hands on. They, they need to interview you. I'm telling you, they, they need me on the war on drugs. War on drugs, get money back, mafia Hell on yeah, that, man. man. Stop on, playing. Man. Cause I'm, I'm still getting geeked up. I need help. <laughs> <laughs> you geeked up now? I'm geeked up right now. Truth, man, that's all. We, we got, got my the truth. homie cheating as married in here, man. Yeah. He just talking his shit. Talk <laughs> you got a lot of fans. They've been trying to get you to come up in here, huh? Hey, come to man. the trap. They've been hitting us in the comments. You ain't been. You... This is not your first time. Nah, this is my first time. This is my man, first time. Man, wait. You my... hang around the wrong people, bro. Nah, bro, I was hanging around the wrong people, but shit, I done figured it out now. Took me three years. Yeah. <laughs> what part of Milwaukee do you represent? Northside, man, 24th from the Locust. That's the, like, the, the, like the middle of the hood. It's rough over there? No, oh, that's rough as fuck on 24th from the Locust. Locust, Burleigh, Center, Cherry, Monarchy. What Owl. kind of rap they used to play in your hood all the time? Hey, what one song that they used to have on repeat? Cuckoo Cow. Cuckoo Cow. Really? Yeah. Projects. You <laughs> went hard. You, you know, you know, like everybody know Cuckoo Cow, bro. Cuckoo Cow was the shit when I was Cuckoo Cow. Cuckoo Cow, yeah, bro. I ain't Cuckoo know he was from Milwaukee, though. Nah, yeah, he, yeah, 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 he from Milwaukee. He shot that video in Milwaukee. Oh, OK. In your hood? Nah, nah, he wasn't oh. from my hood. He was like, Cuckoo Cow was off like Monarchy. Like, he was grown. I was, a, I was in elementary school when Cuckoo Cow did that shit. Mm. Grown already. But Cuckoo Cow, yeah, he from Milwaukee, though. Cuckoo Cow, today, he still, he ain't got no hits, but he still like, you know what I'm saying? He still getting 10 a show. Yes, yeah, yeah. I don't know what he getting to show. I don't know if he doing shows no more. That's how old niggas are saying. I'm still getting ten a show. <laughs> Tell you what? They Cuckoo don't never God, finish. Man, they say ten a show. We had a nigga named Ice Mon back then. It's some. It's some people hot now though. Like that, like Lakia. She from my hometown. Y'all know who Lakia is. She signed to QC right now. Oh yeah yeah yeah. She, yeah. she, she from. She young though. She only like Boy, nineteen. Man, she from Milwaukee. Yeah, she from Milwaukee. She got a song with Mulatto or something. Yeah, 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 she just dropped it. Like, yeah, she from Milwaukee. She born and raised in Milwaukee. I keep up with what Mulatto do. She been down here for like what? a year or two. Why? That's my WCW. You what? Mulatto. You know the woman crush shit that you oh. come up. Yeah, that shit, dog. Cuckoo Cow. You got a crush on Big Lotto? I ain't never heard of Ice Mom. He he did a song with the Yin Yang Twins. That was gonna like, make us know. Shorty thick to them up. I'll try to say that because <laughs> the Yin Yang Twins from here, ain't they? So I thought y'all probably knew it. It was a song, it was a song, the song was it. It was like, I don't even want to sing it because y'all niggas said y'all know him, so I'm going to just be saying it for no oh, reason. Yeah, sing it. D-Wong, D-Wong, show the dick in the motherfucker. Y'all ain't never heard that? Nah, that's why I want to sing it, bro. That's why I want to sing nah, it, bro. Nah, you represent it. But that's how it go. <laughs> and I didn't play the beat, bro. Motherfuckers should have gave me a beat when they did it. You should be saying, D-Wong. Yo, how it go, bro? <laughs> D1, D1. <laughs> then the yin yang twins, yin yang twins come in like, so they get the motherfucker. Boy, that shit was hard. Yeah, I believe. Yin yang twins, Tank from Milwaukee. Tank who? The singer? The singer, he from Milwaukee. Oh, so, that was so. Tank from Milwaukee. Y'all got y'all on that. And yeah. then y'all just won the championship. Jacob Lattimore from Milwaukee. I don't know if y'all, y'all know him, he sings. Yeah, Jacob from Lattimore. the shot. Yeah, he from Milwaukee too. He on the, uh, the show, the shot. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. and, and we just won the championship. It's old. Yeah, no, that ain't old, man. It, it, it ain't that old. I mean, like, it was last year. Yeah, it was. Y'all did it. Y'all got one. Y'all might This year, because we had Chris Middleton. Right. We had Chris Middleton, we would have right. won. That's about accurate, probably. No, ain't no probably. That's a fact. Probably. Walking so. Wisconsin, the Bucks, bro. Real talk, y'all. y'all. Warriors about to take it. You said what? The Warriors about to take yeah, yeah. it. No, I believe that. I, I'm with the Warriors 100%. I don't want Boston to win. I want the Warriors to win. We got, we got two niggas. Look, Milwaukee everywhere. We got two niggas from Milwaukee on the Warriors. Kevin Looney and Jordan Poole. They both born and raised in Boy, Milwaukee. Boy, Jordan Poole, ball. Yeah, he cold. Yeah. He cold for real. Yeah. He different. He like a, yeah. To me, he like, he like mimic Stephen Curry game. 
I ain't calling him Steph Curry. I'm just saying, like, Bro, if you watch. Bro, nobody accuse you of nothing. No, I'm just saying, because I oh. said that to a nigga the other day. They was like, hell no. I'm like, but yes, he we was in there arguing like a motherfucker. Man, I just want Jason Tatum to stop texting Kobe. Like, bro. <laughs> Texting the nigga, you losing this shit. You <laughs> you I got you tonight. Nigga, that <laughs> Stop. Then posting that shit. You know what my favorite part about that last game was? What? But Gary Payton, the second, he tripped like over his own feet. And they showed Gary Payton afterwards. And he was looking like he was just like, man, look at this motherfucker, man. <laughs> dog, you he know that motherfucker probably the told him, dog, wear my shoe. Uh-huh. Son, just wear my shoe. No, fuck that. I'm not the glove. Oh, you don't want to be the glove, nigga? All right. Look at this nigga. That nigga chipped up his own feet and shot free throws. Oh, your own feet and they he caught definitely the chipped, yeah, he, he definitely chipped up his own feet. He definitely chipped up his own feet. Don't say that. <laughs> nah, that's, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Daddies ain't going to never yeah. take blame. They're going to yeah. put that shit on the mama side. And if your pops was in the league, then nigga, he going to want you to. They two, they two totally different type of players, though. I mean, he got a daddy defense, in a sense, but I think he got better defense. Who then? Gary Payton? No, Gary Payton, Gary Payton wasn't pinning uh, shots off the glass. That's why I said it's extra to it. Well, I, 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 I think he ain't no No, he was a glove. He had, he had great knees. What do you think that means? No, I know what that oh. means, the glove. Oh. What? Paul? You say he had good D. Paul, Paul. Hey, man. You can't talk he about had, basketball. He had good defense. You got to say you know good defense. Saying, he, had good defense <laughs> he had good defense, bro. You said he had good D. <laughs> I and then, no. you, then you did the hand like this. No, but I wasn't like, I was like, you know, it's not fuck it. I'm putting my hands on my side. I ain't going to do it. You straight, bro. No, I think you still play pause. <laughs> you say we yeah. still play ball? I can't say nothing, bro. That's what you say whatever you want to. But I ain't going to say nothing like that no more. But yeah, it's a nigga watching yeah, it. They said it. They were like, yeah, oh, Yeah, he pause. had great defense. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Nah, he Gary was great Payton, bro. Somebody. Huh? His son ain't never been in the defensive player of the year running. Not yet. Hey man, his son had a, had a had a whole hell of a journey, man. I ain't trying to take away from that man. Yeah, but I'm saying I know that. D League, he came from a bunch. And of that shit years. dope. He done been a, a like Jesus, traveling yeah. around, but for him to say yeah, by the time he this got come out, defense, he'll be a no. NBA I only champion. said that because he's more athletic. Like Gary Payton went uh, pinning uh, layups off the backboard and stuff like that. Like, I don't he, think he just seen, said, I don't think you seen Gary Payton. No, footage. I watched Gary Payton when he, he was Seattle. So he pinned something off the backboard before. And Gary Payton used to go fuck crazy. I remember him Gary Payton, but camp. I ain't never seen him doing nothing like that. Maybe I gotta pull him up and see if he did that. Yeah, I, I know up. exactly yeah, what he was doing. Sean Kemp. He was pinning stuff off the backboard. Gary Payton. I'm oh, sure he got shit. one of them. One yeah. or two that's of like them. one out of his whole career. He bro. wasn't known for that. That's what I'm saying. He but his son can do it. Still in the fuck. That's what I say. His son do that. He played the passing lane good. He blocking shots off the backboard. And he way more athletic than that. You might a little bit. What you mean? I'm raw as hell. I'm cold. Talking about a little bit. I'm probably like the best comedian. I ain't saying I'm better than another nigga that hooper. Yeah, everybody cold when ain't no rim around. You the, best, ain't no rim you around. the best comedian hooper, you think? Nah, I feel. Who else hoop? Clay who? Yeah. The whole, everybody. Oh, oh, I don't know. I everybody can No, no, everybody is. Everybody, 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 everybody can I know you think you can beat in here. I, 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 put, I put a band on Ooh. him right now. Who? I put money on Joe. <laughs> This nigga when he got Tom Shepard, bro. Like, no, I'm saying, like, who you got What you thing? think you can beat, Joe? If I looked at Joe, I'd be like, I'll bust his ass. But that don't mean nothing, though. Joe gonna go If I looked at Joe, I'd be like, I'll bust his ass. Like, Joe look. Pause. Joe looks slow as hell. Oh, right. No, I, I, damn. Yeah, pause, bro. Yeah. I'll beat him on the court. Shit. So like, you saying you'll beat him? Say if it I look, No, if I looked at him, I feel What you talking about, one on one? Or y'all just talking about, what y'all talking about? Could we be playing what damn the air Wednesday, right? Yeah, I ain't, so what, well, he, I ain't he gonna, must be better than all. Ain't no, no, he, he, he not really good. Y'all think he good. He, he not, not he really good. A whole bunch of niggas that, that I really came. think you'll beat him, but I, I'm going to bet with him because no, Joe my dog. Can't, you can't, you ain't finna try to do no verse psychology. I'm gonna, <laughs> you just told me you out the gate, I better bet on him. Then he said, I really think you'll beat him. I'm trying to get me to fight. Because I'm so looking at, I'm looking at you probably could hoop too, but no, I don't know. No, I ain't no problem. I can't hoop, but I'm just saying. Yeah, you'll beat Joe. Nah, that, that, you, that ain't gonna work on me. I like him for 2500 I'm gonna do it, no. <laughs> bro, Joe beat you with those pants on. <laughs> you crazy as hell. Bro, with I, the glasses too? Glasses too. No, he ain't, but he better be a different type of breed there, Nigga, bro. he shot me. 
Yeah. But that's because you don't play basketball like that. Nigga, he was playing nigga against Joe Johnson, nigga. You don't know even you know what, what, bro. He said, don't even what, bro. He said, bro, <laughs> him and Joe Johnson was shooting for money. Bro, okay. No, nah, that man ain't. The him right there, he not beating me, bro. Right? <laughs> Y'all can say that. Hey, I, I ain't right. saying he weak, but you ain't never seen me hoop either, though. And I ain't got to. So why you, okay. I'm willing to so say 5,000. So y'all, why he ain't in the league or nothing? And that's the rest of my summer, Set money. <laughs> why he ain't in the league? Man, the league hard as hell to get in. You know what I'm saying? So why he, uh, why he ain't in the G League? The, the uh, league the hard as hell. Nigga, he the best direct man in the goddamn nation right now. What the fuck he look oh, like? Oh, okay, well, that's fine. Okay, that's fine, but. Show me some, show me some footage. Let me see what you do. We ain't showing you shit till you put your money. I gotta see that nigga doing layups. You gotta put something. your money down. Show up. I gotta see him doing that. Show up. Bro, huh? He that good. Show no, up. He, he, he that good. Show up. No, I'm not knocking it. He might be good, but he is he that good? He played in Europe and in Greece. <laughs> no, he didn't, bro. He said. Y'all trying to scare me, bro. He didn't. He well, ain't never trying to scare you. Bro, I'm not. I, I would never back down from a challenge though, unless it's an NBA nigga. Like he just had to play me and prove it. Come on. Not, not for free though. Nigga, I ain't gotta play Come for free. Y'all bust his ass. Come, Come on. on. When we doing it next? Yeah. How much? I like, we out there like, next? I'll, I'll let you call the number. How much you gonna play Joe for? I'm playing for a stack. Okay. Set it up. That ain't enough. That ain't enough. What you mean that ain't enough? That's what he said at first. Nah, he said a stack. And she got a, she got a stack. Okay. Right. right y'all talking? Y'all don't scare me with this talk like this. Right. He better. He probably slow as a motherfucker on the floor. He probably. He is. No, he probably good, but that don't mean that, bro. I, I, I'm a different out there, bro. I play with pride. Look, there's some money on the line. Let me tell you one thing. Ain't no thing. way no nigga fit that bust You just gonna be walking out there mad as a mother. You crazy as hell. <laughs> you crazy as hell. <laughs> <laughs> you crazy as hell. <laughs> crazy as hell. <laughs> that nigga just ain't gonna have a shot. Joe gonna show up dressed like the big Lebowski. <laughs> he not. He gonna have a roll yeah. ball, and he gonna, and he gonna drop. drop. He gonna drop 25. Well, I wish I would let a drunk nigga beat no, me. Bro, no, Joe don't. Ain't no drunk nigga beat me. You Joe don't drink money. beer on time out. Like when he gonna take little breaks, he drink. And he beer. finna beat me. Bro, y'all crazy as hell. I can, y'all, I'm not saying he weak, but I his don't care. work ethic different, bro. What? He be running suicides, rolling blunts. <laughs> that's that's enough. Don't scare. Him. That ain't gonna scare me, but I'm I just bet your money. We will. I'm gonna bust his ass, you already man. Gonna set it up in the yeah. What? I'm already ready. This shit gonna be on fan, dude. And the reason why I like Joe, Joe not even gonna bet you. Who gonna bet him? Me. <laughs> <laughs> then me and my boy Joe go out, have a few drinks on you. Nah, Bust he not gonna <laughs> win. Bust a few dollars. We gotta put the money down. Yeah, though, we got ain't no, ain't no, ain't no, we playing oh, and then give me the money. You we put your money down. Nah, we put our money down on the ground. Man, it's down shit. there. I'll let you put it in your pocket. <laughs> Uh, you, that, that still don't scare me. I'm gonna bust his ass. That was really gonna hurt. It's in my pocket. I'm really gonna bust his ass. Yeah, yeah, man. Pause. Stop saying that for you. Upset Pause, you. bro. I said what? Nah, he he edited this show. Hey, that nigga Joe He'll gonna, around Joe gonna say that's when I took it personal. on you, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that nigga Joe gonna keep watching that clip back and back and forth like Michael Jordan. He gonna fucking blur his face out through the whole. You still, you still, you still. Yeah, every time you talk, that shit gonna freeze a little bit. Then you got this one out there. You done? Yeah, I can dunk. It's, it's, it's just a regular dunk. It ain't no. Oh, it's no, crazy. It's just no, a regular you got, dunk. You got real grades. I don't need no, to see no you. I don't need there. to see you dunking, dog. Me, you, you don't think I can dunk? I'm talking about when you playing Joe, you not gonna dunk. You crazy? If you, dunk, game, man. if you dunk, that's gonna be on you. But it's gonna, gonna be, be eleven to two. Who? Y'all going to eleven? You want a better? So, hold on, Tyler. You said he gonna beat me eleven to two. That what I, That's my prediction. <laughs> You, wait, okay, let her better thousand. Oh. You better thousand on that. No, nah, that's another thousand. That's what I said. So, Joe, you see the spread nine points. He, that, see, that's he's right. not gonna beat me eleven to two. Probably gonna be. You probably not gonna score. Yeah, I'm, giving, I'm giving. I'm giving you two. I'm man. giving you two. You might him. get two. He gassed him. He gassed him now, bro. He not gonna hey, score. No, I'm not gonna only I, score two points. I was just. I'm that's like that. I bet with the niggas I know. I, you should. Like if I, if we, that's how it is. Like we win together, we lose together. Wow. But we finna win with you. Yeah, you sound crazy. Shit. I bet. I, he's Bro. Not. I gotta do you cool. Bet. You cool. You cool with Shaq, right? Ask him for Jason Terry number. No, ask him about Joe. I'm not finna call that man. Talk about another guy there. So he gonna put the stuff up. What you talking about? <laughs> Hell no. Nah. Shaq nah. wouldn't play him. I, 
Columbus, Ohio. Ohio. Columbus, Ohio. In Palestine. Columbus. In Columbus. Yeah. The, the, what was it? The yeah. Popeye's Theater? Uh, oh, Palace. I thought it was the Palace Theater and the Popeye's Theater. We going to the <laughs> Palace Theater. Yep. May 21st. Columbus, Not planned. Ohio. You know what I'm saying? Come on. Yeah. Bow Wow yeah. gonna be there. Yeah. And we going to shopping at Eastland Mall. No okay. cap. I'm, I'm going. A little bow wow. You just don't know. Then when you move so fast, hey, I got the blow. I'm gonna make all the money. Okay. Uh, I'm not uh, doing this, uh, bow wow. Yeah. Uh, you boys said, bow wow gonna pull up for me. Hey, you you hey, he gonna pull up for me. All the way. <laughs> Get your tickets, Slim. May 21st. Yeah. No cap. Yeah. 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 Hey, what's up? It's Carlos Miller. I hope you're having a good day. Try some of these candles from my favorite candle brand, Good Day Scents Candle Company. They are black owned and have lots of different scents to choose from. Use my code L O U S, that's Los, and get 25% off your entire order or offer. Let me see. Oh, yeah, we got scents like vanilla, pineapple, sage. Which is my favorite. Egyptian amber. All types of freaky shit like black love. You gotta go on there and check them out. So when you see these candles, just know that I'm having a good day. You know, these candles have been approved by everybody that we ever presented them to. From Snoop and even Beyonce posted these on the website. This one right here, I think. So go hit the website and grab you some of these candles. June 10th. Where we we'll going? Chesapeake Employers Insurance, Insurance Arena. Arena. Ah! Man, nigga must have just bought that. That shit sound like a defect builder, man. man. Hell yeah, in Baltimore, yeah, and that's in that's Baltimore, Baltimore too. Name. That's on the Avenue. Insurance. Chesapeake Insurance. What else is it? Arena. 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 Chesapeake Insurance. I left the word out, but. They got they got three bins in Don't one building. Buy one ticket, <laughs> buy two tickets. Buy how many? Two. And get some insurance while you're at it, cause <laughs> y'all then ain't got no life insurance. Get a few tickets, a few tickets. And we gonna be selling hot dogs. <laughs> That's how they say it. Hot dogs. Hot dogs. Hot dogs on the avenue. <laughs> you dig it? Once well, you we... buy a few tickets. Uh-huh. You gonna get some? Hot dogs. And some insurance, bitch. And some insurance. Chesapeake <laughs> Insurance Arena, Baltimore. Yes, June sir. 10. I can't wait for Baltimore. Baltimore. No, we asked Shaq, and Shaq was like, no, I'm cool. Yeah, that was going to be a waste of time. That's why. Uh, it wasn't. It what was, you talking about? He ain't heard that like joke. Seven hey, feet, seven two, he ain't want no two, smoke seven though, feet. Yeah. Man, he wasn't going to stand the when this show Shaq, over, right? Ryan will show you email. They've been trying to get this man to be a walk-on for the hoes. No, I said that. What's funny? Because he don't even look confident in himself, bro. I'm looking at him, bro. He ain't no confidence. He's probably mad I'm telling him shit. Why you think he grew his shit out? He was supposed to go in when Trey Young come out. <laughs> Yeah, come yeah, on, he profile. Ass, bro. I know he ass. I can that tell. That ain't even a real beard. That's a disguise. <laughs> <laughs> he gotta come looking like that if he play me. He can't come as nobody else besides. He been that. doing stuff. Because I'm gonna say y'all done brought another nigga to the game. Right, he been doing no, stuff. No, if he don't look like Drew. that, if he don't look like that when we play one on one, I'm not gonna play him. He better have that he same wardrobe. He might have a cut by then. You never know. Nah, he got to look like that. He just I'm wake up. You. That nigga fuck around. Got a twin as raw as hell. He not gonna be in basketball attire. I can promise nah. you that. Yeah, he probably be in some Gucci. Lingerie yeah. or something. <laughs> Nigga have a scarf around his neck, fucked to the side like he's about to fly an airplane or something, man. The nigga wow. <laughs> some pink shell to Adidas and some lounge pants. Hell no, nah, bro. It's all about fucking comfort with this guy. Oh, and he man. might have a, a camera holding it while he's playing the whole time. He don't die. Yeah, I know he don't hoop, bro. Y'all saying too much that he gonna do. You right, bro. He gonna hoop with a right. camera in his hand. Don't bro. believe he gonna do this. Don't believe like, shit. Like, bruh, there's no way. You, you know, know the game that you shoot when you go to the fair? They don't let him play that shit. Boy, I remember <laughs> that, that time, that, they banned that nigga. Yeah. That nigga got no, 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 no. That nigga won bro. every teddy bear on that Hey, that nigga so uncomfortable back there because he know y'all lying on him, bro. Look at him. I've been watching him the whole time, bro. He he over there shit. Why bricks. you watching him? Cause, over bro, you? That's the nigga I got to worry about, bro. If he was over there confident, he over there nervous. Bro, that Don't nigga worry. over there yeah, 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 he's yeah. sugar. Go on and talk about something else. Yeah, change the subject, bro. Yeah, man. Who, I didn't Where we him. doing this? Shit, Amazon Prime got some good shit on it. Wednesday. That's some good black people movies on there, bro. 
Hey, unhinged. Y'all watch that on Amazon Bro, Prime. But once Amazon figure out you black, that show you all kind of shit. James be. Brown, live in Zimbabwe. <laughs> it don't even be 1976. Dead. Shit you never even heard of. That shit's true. We got a little Move drill, Nicole, and let's pre put me on that unhinged. What is that about? Russell Crowe, they, the nigga get in the road rage. That shit good as fuck. It's a cat. movie or a series. Somebody that dude that followed that girl. The yeah. Movie. Oh, that movie good as hell. That shit good as fuck. That movie what good is as hell. Amazon. Amazon yeah, Prime. Yeah, that movie real good. All right, bet. It's a good movie. You fuck with it? Fuck you got with a movie it. out? Yeah, uh, <laughs> I got We got Day After Quarantine. You on that? Oh, we yeah, I know. Oh, we didn't hear about the movie. <laughs> huh? Don't say that. <laughs> There's another one. Uh, now we're doing quarantine. I'm on Tubi, like. man. I'm on that Mama D show, but I ain't really want Mama D. They just put that out. Bro. Stop trying to act like you ain't want Mama D. I didn't want Mama D, bro. Bro, you were on Mama D. I saw you like, yeah. like for the love of Mama D. It was called, it's called the, the, the World Love Affair, but I did that when I like I was like six months in the living down here. They asked me to do so it. So you were still homeless. No, I want homeless, bro. You when I moved out here, you trying to live with Mama? You trying to move in with Mama? No, nah, bro. I, 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 did, I did move. Yeah. I had to sleep on the couch. Bro, you was plotting. That nigga was just doing shit. He just wanted the crib, bro. Mama D. No, nah, bro. Everybody who don't know Mama D. So that was like the first to me big thing I did. It when I moved to Atlanta, like everybody know Mama D. Yo, but I forgot a, to introduce you as a reality TV star, man. I ain't no reality TV star. But you was on reality TV with Mama. Oh D. shit, it's Mama D. That what you say when you saw? Nah, hell nah. <laughs> I, 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 I was like, shit. <laughs> I had no other opportunities at the time. All I had was Instagram. I'm like, I'm about to get on this one. You was on that crying. You was trying to be with Mama no, D. No, 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 no. Mama D really, she got a little fat ass, though. I wouldn't hit, though. She had Don't a fat ass. Don't disrespect. Don't disrespect. No, no, Mama, D, not. Mama D had a fat ass. Scrap you, gonna scrap choke you slam me. Come up but here, But you know what's crazy? Cause I got he going to choke slam Don't you, bro. Don't say that, I swear to God, in the I got a whole song with Scrap you. Oh, he going to come out after you. Mm-hmm. He gonna say, and the nigga was in my face. No, nah, hell no, nah, bro. He I'm was like, all in my fist naive, man. No, <laughs> <laughs> nah, I ain't want her, though. Naive. I feel like it was some niggas on there that did want her, though. I didn't. I was just having fun. You though. stay telling on another nigga. That yeah. ain't that, bro. That's your special. Nigga on her. Yeah. But tell on another nigga. Shit that I think don't matter. Damn. Mm. If I say you like. So they, what's the name of the show? The Royal Love Affair, I think. Oh. Love in the title, but he wasn't in love. So what you had got out of it? Y'all got paid and stuff, no? Yeah, we got paid. We got paid. We got paid. But it was just like, it just came out, though. Like She this sent shit. you home? Oh, uh, like, yeah, like on the, like, Which fourth. one, bro? You said no, then, yeah. No, because I was going to answer that question. Then you asked me a question while I was thinking about his question. So I'm I said, I, yeah, chips. I got put on. Shut up, dog. I got sent <laughs> home. Like, I'm going to eat snacks, bro. <laughs> like, it was like four episodes left. I got sent home then. So I lasted a little bit, though. How many episodes is it? Probably, like, 14, 12, 12 to 14, I don't remember. It was a lot of episodes. I don't got there, remember. Yeah. Well, I did that when I first moved here. That shit but just shit, coming out right now. the first two episodes, don't nobody get sent home. They introducing the shit. Yeah, you got nah, sent home the first two nah, episodes? Nah, hell no, nah. I lasted till like, I was like in the last three or four. I want to say four though. How many niggas it started with? It was like 12 of us. But you want one of these? 13 you... of us, I don't got there, remember. You want to rest Christmas tree? I don't remember that. No, nah, hell no. You was looking at the shit all hard. I don't want that. This ain't got it. This motherfucking little ass rice crispy cheese. Why you gotta eat you know, two or three of them, though? Because that when you start no wasting them, you get them goddamn what? regular size motherfucker, you don't eat the whole thing. For what? Yeah. Shit, I do. My skinny ass. I eat all my food. I just don't gain no fucking weight, bro. You lot. will. How old are you? Hopefully. What you mean? Look, these niggas think I'm young. I'm older than now. I'm like Los age. I, I might be older than you, Los. You might be. Finally. Fine. Let these motherfuckers tell I'm the oldest nigga in the world. You 48? Nah, I'm 36. <laughs> I just turned 36 in March. You old as fuck, bro. How old are you? 35? 34? Nigga, you, 31, close, man. you ain't no you, fucking You don't believe nigga. my age to like, you gotta, when he I'm take your head off, when he take your head off, you be like, okay, I see the I just had a rough life. <laughs> no, I'm saying, like, he probably got them niggas looking like. No, bro, but I do a lot of videos with my head off. Why you do that? Yeah, sure, sure, Clayton. Clay 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 you 36. Take it all the way out, bro. Man, you ain't even a zoom in on the phone. No, you ready, man. Shut your ass up. My daddy gave me this forehead. Before I take my head off, my daddy gave me this forehead. So that ain't got nothing to do with nothing, bro. I had this forehead when I was 19. Okay, bro. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> they better have it zoomed in quick. Well, you better be Always quick. Trust me, Joe got you. Look, That's Joe all got they need. That's it, Joe got you. That's gonna be the thumbnail. They got yeah. the thumbnail. Joe got you. Why he good for that? I'm glad you pissed him off with that. You should have never talked yeah, shit. That's the shot he gonna no, use. No, why you looking like, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. No, I'm saying, yeah. No, I, 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 I had to break my forehead, bro. I, I always wear hats. I show this motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't roll. That's why I be, when I meet girls, I don't wear a hat when I first meet them. Cause I don't wanna know. <laughs> cause if I, if, I, if I wear a hat every time and I go on a date and I take this motherfucker off, she gonna be like, what the fuck? I already know you she is. You can't spring that over. Yeah. You can't spring so it over. You, you, no, you gotta show this shit so she be like, when she see it, it's like, she know she, what she fucking she with. She accept it already, yeah. But if I'm like this and shit, like, that's why I gotta wear, if you notice, I always wear my hat like this. Cause when I wear it like this, and you look through there, I look bald as a bitch. <laughs> they be like, I take my shit off. They be like, I thought you was bald head. Uh, bitch, I ain't so you close the window. Yeah, I close the window, bro. I turn it sideways. Yeah. They be like, why you wear your hats like that? Because I don't want them to see, you know what I'm mean? saying? <laughs> if I ain't ready to express it's the photo. It's a method to it. But if Damn, I wear it like this, they be like, they already, in their mind, I'm bald head already. You bro, know you what gotta saying? embrace your baldness, man. Nah, I can't do that, Chad. I'm already ready for that, little I mean, you already bald in the front. Yeah, I am, bro. But I can still do this, nigga. I know how to take pictures, bro. I didn't, pa- I didn't practice I, angles and shit. In a minute, you ain't gonna have I no choice. Niggas, I be having niggas stand on tables and take my picture and shit, bro. I just, you just gotta be. Nah, man, fuck it. You gotta wrinkle that motherfucker. I don't know how my head gonna look without no hair on it. Gonna look fucked up. Now, your shit like perfect. Your shit. Don't, don't dog, say that. Don't shit, do that. Yeah, your shit don't different. do that. I was trying to be nice, but that's don't, you don't have to. Different. You don't have to. But I ain't gonna wait. It's not for you. I'd rather go ball here first then, like right you here. You are? Where you go ball at first? Don't say you are. Right where you starting at? <laughs> <laughs> but there's nothing wrong yeah. with this. You crazy as fuck. <laughs> Look how far your eyebrows are from your head. No, but <laughs> that's where you go in, bro. Hey, I don't even got no eyebrows. Bella, my forehead looks so big. You can be like your eyebrows light, like, bro. If I had dark, if I had this, if I had Dawson, look how far your eyebrows is from your head. Just put your, just put <laughs> your, put your, your I tell you what, my eyebrows are a little darker. My shit wouldn't look that big. Put bro. your thumb on your eyebrow and then see no, if you can touch I your head. I got some big ass hands. And no, that's I'm saying like if you put your thumb on your eyebrow and then I bet you can't touch your hairline. If I put what? Put your thumb on your eyebrow. I ain't finna do that shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to figure it out. I'm trying to mess with I'm trying to mess with that shit. That shit ain't gonna reach. I told you, nigga. That nigga about to do the Izzy Vicious Fire. Y'all said the nigga about to do the Izzy Vicious Fire. That nigga finna get home. <laughs> you got two good summers left. Basically. You better enjoy it. Nah, bro. My shit been like this. It's gonna be. How many years? Bro, and I just so go for the four hundred one k. Bro, my forehead, my forehead been this big. Oh, okay. My daddy head was like this. I was one of them niggas just had a big forehead. They used to roast me in high school and shit. Come back in two years. What? My shit gonna be the same. No, it's not. If my shit go there, I, bro, bro, I'm gonna let my shit go till it come like that. I don't know. Oh, hell, that's, that's, <laughs> you go I, yeah. Bro, I, I don't know. I just wear hats then. Okay. Bro, I'm not, I don't know, I can't go ball like most. I can't, I don't. You don't, you need, hey man, the only reason I'm I wear that, that shit is stay in the house at this my shit point is just see. to keep the sun off my ball head. Bro, if I, if Chico can do what he did, bro, like, then, you know what I'm saying? It's hopefully, you better go and start growing your shit out now, though. No, when I grew my shit out, that shit, nigga, that shit, the olive, like how I look on the camera, I gotta do this. See? When I do this shit, it look like I ain't got nothing but <laughs> face. That's fucked up. Damn, it ain't you, number face on that motherfucker. Look, I look like a cancer patient. They, they and shit. pause it right there. I look like 50 cent on self destruction on that niggas motherfucker. Niggas gonna be like, when y'all have Tory Lanez on that bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Put my shit back on, man. I already exposed my head. No, I said we got Tory Lanez on You still about the truth? Uh, <laughs> hey, you know how they be in the comment? Finally, they got Tory Lanez. Oh, man. I Damn, gotta watch this one. Ask them what happened that night. <laughs> What we're doing, we are now showing you just how important having the 85 South Show app is because you was watching this show thinking, oh, they done finally put the shit back on YouTube. No. They was listening. We weren't. We weren't. It's on the app. It's on the app. The rest of this, listen, the rest of the audio is on the app. <laughs> 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 Now you gotta 
know what we Woo. said? You gotta go get the app. That's the 85 South Show app. It's available on Amazon, Five Stick, Apple TV, wherever you get your subscription. No, it's not. It's, it's just, not on it's Apple just TV? available directly where they sell apps. Or oh, they don't sell apps on Apple TV? It's well, y'all should fuck with us too, Apple TV. Roku. Hell, roll with y'all. It fuck is Roku. on there. Put it on Roku. Don't say fuck nobody. No, I didn't say fuck them. I said put it. I think we fuck with them. Oh, we do. My house full of Rokus. Oh. It's Roku remote everywhere. Yeah. So subscribe to the app. It's only $8.99 a month or $85 a year. So you get a whole year for $85. Did yeah. you know that? It's $8.50 and then you got to pay tax. Yeah. So, you know, it's $8.50. You know, we get them all type of content. You know what? We're not even going to tell them who you got your glasses from until they get it on the app. I mean, hey, you got to watch the app. The app is available. All of these people that say we should keep putting this on YouTube for free. What about the years of freeness that we've already provided upon you? We gave this away for Let's free for years. Let's move together. Why would you let somebody come invest in the show and put it on another network and you're buying their subscription? You don't ask them why you're buying their shit. So don't ask us. We're putting it on the app. Who's over the app? Nobody knows. Get the app. Yeah. We saw what you said in the comments. We, sure we saw it. We saw everybody. The good, the we bad. Read every fucking comment. And the ugly. So you know what? We folding under this pressure. Sure we hear you. We hear you. We win and did. We'll just get the fuck on at y'all way. Just for an hour though. Yep. That's yep. all you get is an hour. So don't you can't complain. Well, where the rest of it? I at? think they should get 37 minutes. Oh, see, we gotta hurry up. We should up. put a whole bunch of ads in between, like long ads, ads, like five minute ads. Hey, how you doing? Uh, you <laughs> slow motion ads. Slow, slow it down. <laughs> Waste a motherfucking time. Yeah, uh, let's just uh, go ahead and make sure. Channel85.com. I want to make sure I read what they wrote. They wrote some shit out for us. These niggas don't know how to spell or type proper sentences, but they trying get to get us to get y'all to buy the app. What, you think we want to read this shit? Channel85, man. So we can talk that shit, man. Ladies, don't you like this deep thrust? Huh? Go get it on that's right, on the app, uncensored, unfiltered, and edited. Can you believe that? I'm talking about with actual production in it. Thanks. Jump cuts, yep. clips, all types of type of like exclusive shit that they don't even know that we did. They don't even know that we got a show where we be cooking like exotic foods and shit. Okay. That's on the app. Sports show. Yep. Talk show, documentary. Chico got a handwriting class that he teach. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody passed it, cause Nobody. that's why the shit looked like right. this. But we're working on it, and you can see it on the app. They didn't, the e app. didn't even tell them about the tax course that we had uploaded on there. No cap. They don't even know that we, we got a we whole show about Wall Street. And a five thousand dollars on the app. Right. <laughs> and we got the alternate ending to the color purple up there. Oh right. man. No cap. We got the raw edition, all the uncut, all the bloopers. We got all that. Right. It's on the app. So if you want to see. Some shit that you know they trying to hide from you. Go to that. I'm leaving though. Channel85.com. Go get the app. You got an hour for free. We gave you what you wanted. Now give us some subscriptions to the app. $8.50, $8.99 with tax, $85 a year. Channel85.com, 85 South Show. Get the app. Well, see, this is what they don't know. The app really $3, but adjusted for inflation is $8.00. Done. Yeah. What Lo said, get the app, man. Stop bullshitting. We out of here, man. We not about to keep working all this time for. Been working for free. Uh, we are going on app, baby. We are going on app. We on your way to fly. Oh, yeah.